Era for the Philadelphia Police Department. Good evening, everyone. I'm Natasha Brown. I'm Joe Holden. Yuki and Jessica are off tonight. So for the first time, Philadelphia's police commissioner will be an African-American woman. She's vowing to reduce crime and hold officers accountable. Our Matt Petrillo is live at City Hall right now where the new commissioner was introduced to the public earlier today. Matt. Well, city officials said today after a four month long nationwide search, Danielle Outlaw will be the city's next top cop. They called the decision historic. It was time for uh, an outside fresh look. Philadelphia Mayor Jim Kenney has high hopes for the city's just announced police commissioner, 43 year old Danielle Outlaw. I just think it's her directness. I think it's her intelligence. I think it's her experience um, that uh, gave me confidence that this is the right. This is the right person for the job. Outlaw is currently the police chief in Portland, Oregon, where she oversees about a thousand officers in Philadelphia. She'll lead a department of 6500 men and women in blue. While I'm new to Philadelphia, I am not new to the challenges of a big city or 21st century policing. The decision to offer outlaw the city's position of top cop closes a rocky year in the Philadelphia Police Department, according to activist Solomon Jones. We hope that she succeeds because if she doesn't, it's going to be our lives that are at stake. Some incidents over the past year include in August when six officers were shot during an eight hour standoff in Nicetown, Tioga. A week later, former Philadelphia Police Commissioner Richard Ross resigned after being accused of turning a blind eye to a culture of sexual harassment in the department. Outlaw says she's equipped to handle the job, but she adds she doesn't want her being the city's first African-American woman police commissioner to define her. I've been a black woman all my life, and I chose the career of law enforcement, so I happen to be a police officer who's a black woman. And Danielle Outlaw also explained several policies she hopes to confront when she takes the job in February. Here are those coming up on Eyewitness News at 6. Reporting live at Philadelphia City Hall, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Big moves with the department today, Matt. Thank you for that live report. We'll see you then. DA Larry Krasner released this statement in response to Outlaw's hiring. It read in part, quoting, as an outsider to Philadelphia, you are well positioned to act during a time of needed reform on the ideals you have expressed. We are hopeful that your deeds will match your words, he wrote, and you will push for justice because we all know that justice makes us safer. Stay with Eyewitness News for continuing coverage of the new police commissioner. We'll have much more on the new woman in charge and reaction to today's appointment on TV and, of course, always at CBSPhilly.com.